just going to top off in the low 70s. It's a warm start. We're in the 40s right now. There's actually a touch of fog. Winds are light, but look at our forecast highs. It could go into the mid 70s in spots in Poria. The record for today is 77. We're not going to be too far off that record. Now we're ahead of a cold front. The high temperature today back up into the northern plains in uh, Minneapolis. It's only going to be in the 40s, so that cold front's going to work in. It'll drop our temperatures by about 10 degrees for tomorrow. So today 73, some increasing clouds, and with calm conditions and relatively warm conditions this morning, there's a little bit of fog. But if you are a warm weather fan, you're loving today almost as much as yesterday. Um, as the winds will climb into the low 70s. We'll have more clouds today versus yesterday, and we'll track the hour by hour forecast. So starting with morning clouds, and then the clouds kind of increase into the afternoon, but it's not going to be a dark or dreary day. This is 7 o'clock this evening. They're going to get a good soaking rain on the other side of the state line back in West Virginia. And as this front kicks over the mountains, there will be some rain but not a lot. Now these are areas here that just got classified yesterday as moderate drought, including uh, from Spotsylvania down through Cumberland and Farmville. And there probably will be some rain for those of you north and west of town, but this is not the kind of rain that's going to recharge the groundwater and soak everything. It's going to be a few hundreds of an inch. And then watch what happens when I hit the button here. And we're going to go from one o'clock tomorrow morning, basically midnight. Um, through the middle of the day. The rain chance just falls off the map, so that'll dry up. We think that front dries up, so we just have a 10% rain chance tonight. Temperatures in the mid 50s, so a warm night, and then tomorrow that is our first alert weather day. On our double weekend forecast, we've got a high temperature tomorrow in the low 60s. In general, kind of a pleasant day, except for the fact that we have that high wildfire threat. Just be really careful with anything that could start a fire. Use extreme caution is the wording we're going with for the day tomorrow. Sunday 60, again, without the wildfire threat, that's just kind of a breezy, typical autumn day, but it's so dry out there. Then we have a great chance here. 70% rain chance and holding for Tuesday. That's a soaking rain. That could be an inch, could be maybe more. That'd be great news. Not the best for travelers, maybe, but a good soaking rain is just what we need. It dries out quickly on Wednesday. Look at how chilly it's going to be on Thanksgiving, only in the upper 40s. We'll stay cooler than normal for next week with a chance of rain developing by Sunday of next weekend. Ashley, back over to you. All right, Andrew, thank you. Internet and telephone